You'll never guess who's awake. You're shitting me. Come see for yourself. How long has it been? Years. I stopped keeping track a while ago. I can't believe it's been that long. Time flies when you're watching someone breathe through a tube. How's the family? My wife's cheating on me with an altar exec, and uh, my daughter sits in her room listening to Aisha albums all day. Oh, for a dead woman, she sure releases a lot of records. <laughs> no shit. God, that was a hell of a year. Alderman Hughes, Mayor Winslow, Aisha, Chief Monroe. All murdered by that asshole who's been sitting in intensive care on taxpayers' money. He said he wouldn't pull the plug. Lord knows why. Anyone call the chief? Couldn't get through. The press has been mobbing him with phone calls. Oh, about the... Yep. I forgot that was today. You should pay more attention. Fuck off. How's the patient? Seeing as they're still breathing after being caught in a massive explosion, I'd say pretty good. Coming through! What happened? Shanking. Put him over there. Sorry about that. Have they said anything yet? Not yet. But I'm about to take the bandages off. Yes. That looks like it healed nicely. Be careful, doctor. Your patient's dangerous. You got anything you want to say to the judge, you better start thinking of it now. You're wasting your time. Let's get a hold of Troy. Psst. Hey! Is it really you? Do I know you? My brother was in the Saints and he told me all about you. Listen, we gotta get you out of here. Well, I'm sure if we ask nicely. I know a way out. Yeah? Then why are you still here? I heard you were in here and I wanted to bust you out. Getting out of here is a two-man job and no one else will give it a try. You really expect me to trust some guy I don't even know? Come on, I just got myself shanked so I could get a chance to talk to you. Doesn't that show I'm loyal? It shows that you're dumb enough to let yourself get stabbed. I'm trying to help you. You know what I got the last time I trusted someone? Blowing the fuck up. You need me. The hell I do, I got the sights. <laughs> sure you do. What's that supposed to mean? How long do you think you've been out? Oh, I don't know, mate. Two to three weeks. Look, I know you think you're a badass, but do you even know where you're at? Without me, you'll be wandering around the prison for hours. Even if you manage to hide from the guards that long, and if you actually figure out how to make it outside these walls, you're just gonna find out that you're sitting on a goddamn island. And I'm pretty sure you can't outswim the Coast Guard. You got a boat stashed here? No, but I know where we're gonna steal one. All right, let's get out of here. You can either try to sneak out through the roof or charge out the front. Your car. Let's get to the docks. I can drive us out of here. I can't believe I'm breaking out of jail with you. Just stay focused, little man. Gonna lie. Got no idea who the hell you're talking about. Telling me you didn't know this was gonna work. I'd get you out of here. Yeah, let's not start celebrating till we're off this damn island. Man the 
gun. I'm gonna get us out of here. It is now. Jesus, when did this happen? <laughs> when Ulter got involved. The clothing coming? After Hughes was killed in that bombing of yours, Ulter picked up the pieces. Now they're everywhere. On TV, on billboards, in stores. Hell, if you ever forget who Ulter is, just look towards Saints Row and you'll see that fucking eyesore. Here we are. We're gonna find the other Saints. <laughs> what other Saints? What you talking about? Without anyone to lead them, the Saints fell apart. Once the Brotherhood, Ronin, and Samdi showed up, the few that were left dropped their flags before they got killed. Oh, that's fucking great. Look, I know you didn't ask for it, but my advice is to just keep your head down. The cops are looking for you and a lot's changed. I say you just go buy a beer and soak up as much information as you can. Thanks, Carlos. Anytime. choice.
ended last year in an assassination attempt against then-decorated police officer Troy Bradshaw. In the resulting trial, Gatt was convicted of one count of attempted murder and a staggering 387 counts of first-degree murder, promptly sending him to death row. Hey, Barry, turn this shit off! Yeah, I was watching that. I guess you're not anymore, are you, bitch? Could you turn the TV back? In a few short moments, we'll be allowed back in the courtroom and we'll find out, once and for all, if Mr. Gat will go home a happy man or a dead one. Back to you, Jack. Oh, shit. Surprise! This is. I'm gonna take that. Shit! What a Mr. Gat, you've been convicted of over 300 murders. Do you really expect this appeal to work? I figure with the statute of limitations, it really should be closer to 250. There's no statute of limitations for murder! Why the fuck not? Watch yourself, Mr. Gat. Or what? You hold me in contempt of court? You're already planning on giving me the chair. You think I'd give a shit about you not liking me? Fuck off. I'm curious if you can keep your cavalier attitude when 2,000 volts are running through your body. Oh yeah? And I'm curious if you can keep acting like a douchebag when I shove that gavel up your ass. My client would like that stricken from the record. What's that? Drop it. Uh, anyone hit and need a lawyer? About time your burnt ass woke up. You okay, Johnny? Yeah, aside from almost getting sent to the chair, I'm fucking great. Hey, you look different. You do something with your hair? You ready to get out of here?
thanks for busting me out. Aisha would have killed me if I got executed. You still with Aisha? Yeah, I mean, got a little tricky with me on death row and her being on the DL after faking her own death. You know, we found a way to make it work. How long were you in jail, anyway? Two years and 31 days. Yeah, not like you were counting. Yeah, right? You know, it's weird. People inside were betting on my life. Lives. See, when I was first busted, the guys always trying to put me in the ground. After Troy became chief of police, it all stopped. Troy must be more forgiving than I am. Troy's the chief of police? Yo, you better start getting with the times. Julius is missing, Ben King wrote an autobiography, Dex is a... You know, don't even get me started with Dex. But the real kicker is Troy. In a couple of months, he went from undercover cop to chief of police. And word is, he's become obsessed with finding out what happened on your little boat trip with the Alder. If I get some free time, I might they swing by the station and say hello. From the forces of X. Come on in. You want a beer? Yeah, it'd be great. Johnny, who's that? Yo, come to the living room and find out. Johnny, I don't care if you just broke out of jail. You do not mess with my furniture. Oh my God, it's you. Surprise, Aisha. What? That you're here, or that you're talking? Pick one. We all thought you were dead. I almost was. Well, for someone who was blown to hell, you look great. <laughs> Did you do something with your hair? Yeah, I've been getting that a lot. Yo, can we get back to business? What's the rush? I've been cooped up on death row and that bitch has been laid out in a coma. Hmm. We definitely need to remind motherfuckers who we are. And that can't wait until after dinner? No. no. <laughs> you two haven't changed at all. Well, you know, there's a saying about dogs and blowing shit up. <laughs> so what's the plan? We get our crew together. Once we got that, we can work on how we're taking back our city. Sounds good. And where were you planning on having this little meeting? No. Well, this place is pretty spacious. No. The color's very soothing. No. Come on, Ish. This ain't no fucking gang clubhouse. Change of plans. We gotta find a new place. Yeah, you got it. What the fuck we standing around for? Let's shoot something. Head over to the old mission house. We should be able to set up shop there. Why don't we just set up shop at the church? Altor's renovated it and turned it into a tourist trap. You're kidding me. I wish I was. We gotta find a new place and the mission house will be perfect. Religious buildings are kinda been there, done there. And we're not staying in the mission. Now check it out. Years ago, an earthquake dropped part of the city below sea level. And rather than clearing out the rubble, the city just built over it. There's an abandoned hotel below the mission that'll work for us. All right, what's the catch? We got to evict the current tenants. Sounds like fun.
worth my time. So, what you think? It's kind of a shithole. True that. But it's a shithole with potential. I don't know, mate. Oh, come on. A stripper pole, some flat screens, maybe some nicer furniture? You have me a stripper pole. Fucking A. You know, this ain't exactly what I had in mind for my day. Oh, we gotta clean this place out. Yo, I'm not a fucking janitor. No shit, you're a goddamn diva. Come on, this is the kind of shit people who just got canonized should have to do. Good idea. We'll just ask some of the crew for help. Hey, buddy, wanna help? No? Looks like we're doing this ourselves. That's my point. We can't really run a gang if we don't have, you know, a fucking gang. You said it yourself. Most of the old crew are either dead or busted by Troy. We're gonna have to start fresh. Yeah, well, let's get on that, cause I'm done mopping up blood. This kid Carlos helped me bust out. Seems alright, but we're gonna need more. What you thinking? Yo, I met some people in jail who might work. Let me make some calls. Once I find out where these bitches are, you're gonna have to show them that you're the real deal, though. They won't just follow anybody. It won't be a problem. Hey, before you go, what sort of crew you looking for?
I'd love to help the Saints, but first you need to do me a favor. A deadbeat friend of mine owes me money. Can you help me repossess his car? How you been? Busy. Yeah, I heard what you did at Johnny's trial. Well, I couldn't let my boy fry. You know, a guy from jail. You know, I saw Johnny in prison once. He didn't look like a really happy guy. Oh, he's happy enough when he's killing somebody. <laughs> no, seriously, no, he's a good guy. Just don't piss him off. Hey, Ramon, what's up? Listen, I don't got a lot of time. I was just calling to let you know that <laughs> I stole your car. Are you there? Great. Here's the deal. If you don't want your car cubed, I really suggest you pay me what you owe me. Talk to you later, Ramon. Yeah, you're in, Carlos. I'll meet you at the old mission. Just fight for me, pugilist. Give me the fucking car! What's up? I'm Pip. If I'm gonna run with you, I wanna see you fuck some Ronin up. Being with your crew. Good. Meet me at the abandoned mission house. I'll be there. I'm Shandi. What do you say you show me what you can do in that thing?
would you say we go and meet the rest of the boys, Shondi? Good times. Let's go. What the hell is going on? I had to do some canonizing. Hold up. You. You're next. Wait, what? Sorry about that. Where'd you find these guys? Like I said, I made some calls. You guys actually hang out down here? I don't know. Add a flat screen, some throw pillows, and a hookah, and this place would be all right. You definitely need a stripper pole in this bitch. Definitely. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So what do we do now? We listen. <sighs> All right, everybody listen up. We got some serious shit to discuss. The Saints used to own Stillwater. And it seems like the only motherfuckers that remember that is me and Gat. I think it's time we give those other crews a wake-up call. <laughs> now, I ain't gonna lie, a lot of shit's changed since I've been out of the game. So I'm gonna need some help. Pierce, you're on the Ronin. I wanna know who's calling the shots and what businesses they're running. Done. Shondi, you got the sons of Sandy. It's gotta be them. Fuck you, say. It's cool. I, I got this. Carlos. The Brotherhood. I'm on it. All right. Once we're done here, talk to one of these guys. They'll have something for you to do. It's our time now. Let's get this shit started. Yeah.